Good morning and uh, tight. Um, Good morning. The latest transfer news is um, <laughs> Ryan Fraser. Ryan, Ryan Fraser. What, what, what's Ryan your Fraser. On Ryan Fraser. Would you? A superb player. Yeah. A superb player. Very talented. Superb player. Have we got already uh, a, 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 a lot of the a, players like that? Alex Awobi. Uh, yes. Julian Alex. Shankar. I mean, yes, still yeah. developing and still Absolutely. coming. Absolutely. So, but you're happy if we buy, uh, pay 30 million for Ryan Fraser? I don't know about 30 million. I don't know about that. It's, it's, um, it's transfer to Augism yet, so. I don't know about that, but I think it's, I think it's a brilliant player. I don't know if um, Portsmouth would want to sell him. I don't know if he want to leave Portsmouth, but you know, it's just rumour, so who knows what the truth is. But like you said, I think we've got people in there, but it's like Alex, you know. So, uh, know, even though we do need a win, I suppose. Yeah, uh, would you prefer uh, someone like Pepe? Uh, would you, I know it would cost more money, but... Pepe would be brilliant. Or, or are we just saying that because uh, he's foreign, he's got a he's foreign man. <laughs> But I don't know, I mean, I've watched Ryan Freight, he's had one good season for Bournemouth. If you look at the other two seasons, he's not really done I much. think he's had more than one good season, but you know. Yeah. I don't know, I think he's a good, I think he's a very good player, but I don't know. It's a rumor, I don't know. Pepe, Pepe's another good player as well. So, well, yeah. We're on our way today. Tell, uh, tell where we're on our way to watch. We're on our way. We're on our way. We're on our way to Arsenal Grenfell. Fan TV. We're on our way. Yeah. Anyway, um, yeah, that's where we're on. Hopefully, we're going to play and hopefully we're going to play. A few days, to, for Baku, few days to go to Baku. Um, yeah. Danny Welbeck in the squad. In the squad. Travel Which is good the news. Squad, he's traveling the squad, very happy. Yeah. Like you said, I don't know how fit it will be, but he's an option off the bench if needed. So um, we'll have to see. We'll have to see. So it's full, uh, very uh, strong squad taken to uh, Baku. Absolutely. Uh, looks like no real injuries. Um, apart from no Mkhitaryan, but Henrik, which is a what's your thoughts on shape? that? I mean, do you think Arsenal should have acted a bit earlier? I mean, are they being a bit too funny about it, considering they didn't make a fuss about it when he was left out in the group stage? No, no. But then we didn't know who was going to get to the final. Possibly, maybe we should have. Maybe we should have. But you never know if you're going to get through to the final, do you? That's the thing, so we didn't know. We didn't know. But maybe, yeah, possibly we should have made a fuss of it altogether and expressed our concerns to UEFA. Yeah. Yeah, it's a shame. It's a shame that he doesn't let, feel that he's safe. Too late to start complaining now. I mean. Possibly, but it's still a disgrace that yeah, a player doesn't agree, go yeah, yeah. because they don't think that they they're going to be safe. I think that's ridiculous. Had it been a more high-profile player, yeah, like, like Ronaldo, think, um, or Messi, or Ronaldo, yeah, that yeah. wouldn't have happened. No, it wouldn't have happened. It wouldn't have happened. So yeah. it's a disgrace. But well, you know, all we can do is hopefully win. You know. And they get back into Champions League, and hopefully that situation never ever happens again to oh. any player of any country, because it's a disgrace. It's an absolute disgrace. And I think UEFA could come out and do more and say more, because I haven't heard UEFA saying it's so sad that Henrik is not, he's not, he's not feels he's not safe. You know, yeah. I think that's ridiculous. Well, I think the whole venue is ridiculous. I think the whole should have been just said in August. I think everyone should have complained about it then. Apparently no one has anyway. No. Yeah, we're on our way to watch a uh, Arsenal fan TV FC. football football club play their game against Grenfell FC. So mm -hmm. talk to you, speak to you soon. Yeah.